There's a lot to be proud of here at West Coast. The business has just celebrated its 35th anniversary and it's Britain's largest privately owned IT company. It employs 1,600 people. And of course, it doesn't just revolve around one individual, but around many people, past and present. And of course, there are many people through those doors today that are all proud of working for West Coast. What you're seeing here is one of the keys to our success. West Coast offices are all open plan. No one is locked away to tackle a problem on their own. It's right here where we closed the world's largest HPE green lake order just a few months ago. And it's here that we broke the news about our biggest year yet, achieving 2.5 billion turnover and record profits for 2018. Things aren't looking too bad for 2019 either, with forecast organic growth to 2.8 billion. And once again, we're right on target. In fact, it's James and his new systems integrator team over there that's driving a chunk of this growth. We all know the IT landscape is changing, which is why we have to change with it. As system integrators make the move to buying from distribution, we've created a new sales team dedicated to SIs to assist with deal registration and bids on behalf of these large organisations that need help navigating vendor processes, as well as training, configuration and deployment. We've already onboarded 11 new partners in the last 18 months and we're predicting over 100% growth to 40 million in 2019. Our customers and vendor relationships are at the centre of everything we do. It's why we exist and it's why we're so proud of what we've achieved with them in the last year. We're the number one UK distributor for some of the biggest technology companies in the world, like HPI, Apple, Microsoft, Lenovo and HPE, but we're always looking to improve. For example, this year we have made some investments in tools like Merlin to drive more off-the-shelf product with shorter lead times. We've also made some operational improvements to enhance our customer experience around the Lenovo bid process. And as a result, we've recently celebrated reaching 41% share of the commercial UK market. It's because of our commitment to going above and beyond expectations that resellers rely on us time and time again. Just like M2, who partnered with us to roll out 2,500 printers to the John Lewis partnership within a three month period. To roll out that many devices in such a short time frame was always going to be a massive challenge. And tracking is going to be an absolute crucial part of the project. So we tracked the serial MAC addresses of each unit right from the start and optimized and expanded our team to triple our daily run rate and tailored the reporting to M2's specific requirements. I'm happy to say that we delivered all of them pre-configured and ready to go well within these timeframes, and it was a really proud moment for the team. An extraordinary sales team deserves to have access to exceptional tools, like a new deal tracker, so team leaders and vendor managers can track large deals and get involved in conversations from the beginning, rather than being bought in late by a customer and then having to work backwards. We've also rolled out Zendesk to our technology solutions division so that the sales team can go through the deal reg process and bid on behalf of our resellers saving partners crucial time and effort, and growing our HPE business by 10 million, making us their distributor of the year once again in 2018. Providing a great customer experience is the responsibility of everyone in West Coast, not just those on the front line. Our recent IT investments have included the introduction of new support tools, such as CRM to help customer services. Also, there are fantastic new initiatives around an innovative hybrid cloud solution. This benefits our customers and our vendors. Here at West Coast Cloud, we believe in doing things differently. We live in a world full of innovation and we want our customers to feel that we're with them every step of the way. Our people go the extra mile to ensure that we're supporting our partners in the way that they feel that they should be supported. We're incredibly proud of the heritage and strength that is West Coast. This company is built on strong foundations of openness, great service and honesty, with a passion for delivering the right service to our partners. We know that a good business experience leads to more business, but we haven't always been good at taking time to step back and celebrate the praise we've had from our partners. We decided that needs to change, which is why we've now got a section on our website dedicated to our standout partner stories, where we can reflect on what we've achieved and what we've learned from each one. We also have a board where we encourage visitors who have had a positive experience of working with us to tell us why. It's a great start to the day because that's the first thing you see when you come into the office. The focus we're making on customer advocacy is part a wider move to make sure we all know what we're doing right and to make sure we're looking at everything that goes into the sales funnel rather than just the end result. 
As a business operating in the Thames Valley, we owe a great deal to our community, which is why we're constantly engaging with it. We're proud to be advising local enterprise partnerships and chambers of commerce, as well as working with young people in schools. Just last year, we set up the West Coast Bright Sparks programme, which sees our staff going into local schools to show the possibilities that come from IT. In fact, as a result of this programme, we've already recruited many apprentices and we're aiming to recruit many more before the end of 2020. I wanted to work in a place where there was a lot of opportunities to grow and progress but also somewhere where I could make a difference and where gender doesn't hold you back from making a positive contribution to the company. As an apprentice at West Coast I've gone from entry level responsibilities to managing and coordinating the training attendance for our whole sales force. The best thing about this was seeing the impact I could make. Training engagement increased by 20% and it meant that our business will thrive because the teams had the latest knowledge and skills to help their customers and it was great to see that direct effect. No matter what level people join West Coast at, we've now improved our new starter programmes so that every office-based member of staff has a two-day induction. We also have a fully auditable employee training system delivering e-training to all relevant staff. And a new voice of West Coast committee made up of staff from around the business to discuss shared issues that are ultimately reported back to the operational board. We're doing our utmost to make sure everyone has a voice at the table because good employee involvement and good corporate governance means good business. There is a vast amount to be proud of here at West Coast. And it's not about what we have achieved, but what we can still achieve. It is the most exciting business uh, in the UK and Britain's largest privately owned IT business. That is why I, I'm proud to work at West Coast. I'm proud that we have 11 nominees for the Women in Channel Awards. I'm proud that we have retained all major tenders and won more for 2019. I'm proud of our work supporting startups like our sponsorship of the Connect TVT event. I'm proud that even in the current economic climate, we're thriving and growing. I'm proud that we've doubled our operational capacity by opening a new warehouse facility in Andover. I'm proud to be part of West Coast. I'm proud to be part of West Coast. I'm proud to be part of West Coast. Who here is proud of working for West Coast? I am!